What is going on guys? Welcome back to a brand new episode of WWE Supercard here on the channel. If you guys enjoy this content, don't forget to like, comment, subscribe as always. I greatly appreciate it if you do. So in this video, I just want to go over some stuff that I want to discuss. So as you guys can clearly see on my screen, WWE Supercard is going down for a maintenance period on June 12th, which is tomorrow at 10 a.m., which is 11 Mountain Time, 12 Central, and 1 Eastern. 6 o'clock in the UK, 6 p.m. So, expect a long downtime between 2 to 8 hours. I know they already had the update out, but knowing these maintenances for new tiers, they do tend to take longer than usual. And that's the facts. But lucky for us, uh, the whole situation with the update, updating the app stuff, we don't have to wait for iOS and Android users, we are in the clear. They'd move that forward, so shout out to Supercard for at least fixing that problem we always have. Thanks for letting me know that, Supercard. So, uh, we already finished uh, Shayna Baszler. And we're going to go ahead and claim her right here, right now, as always. Now, I didn't do exceptionally well in this. Uh, I think I got like maybe six or seven shards. Yeah, it was seven shards, so it kind of slacked a little bit. But, you know, I'm trying to get back into my groove and so forth, so yeah. But, uh, oh man, they got the art pack in here. Don't buy it. Uh, so yeah, guys, the brand new tier comes out tomorrow. Uh, will I have a video? I don't know. It's a toss-up at this point. So, uh, yeah, I don't know if I'll have one tomorrow. But do check me out on Thursday, guys. We'll be live for a good good amount. I'd say a, few, a, good hour, a good amount of hours on Thursday. So do come check out the stream, hang out with us, see what the new tier's like, yeah, and then I'm sure we have Rose to Glory at 3 p.m. Come and check us out at 3 p.m. for the brand new tier stuff. So that would be freaking awesome. Uh, who knows if we're going to get ladder rewards. I hope they give out ladder rewards because I didn't get anything for uh, the other one, but I don't know if I'll get any ladder reward. What is the highest one? 350. So if we do get lucky, we will get either a 375 or a 400k one. Uh, I think they should require these lower. To be fair, I think every 25k is kind of outrageous at this point for a lot of people. Uh, then there's a 50k gap here, another 50k, and then here it's more reasonable 15k, 10k. See, th these are actually reasonable, but when you get to these levels as not many people as play as much as I do, it's kind of outrageous. So, yeah, that's kind of insane. Uh, but we do got a fusion here, so uh, we'll go ahead and uh, get this fusion. I think that's all I got, yeah. I'm hoping for Peyton Royce. Peyton freaking Royce. Give me Peyton Royce. That would be awesome. Please don't say new card. Please don't say new card. Don't say new card. <sighs> Why? Oh, my God. I keep getting singles out of like, my fucking day job. It's crazy. Well, I, I could still make like five or six more of those fusions, which is a good thing. So, but man, like I, I need females really bad for the next tier. Because uh, uh, I'm going to have to pro my Becky in this next coming one for sure. As you can see, like we're fine. I didn't get Mankind, but I still have a 24 Rick Rude that is just fine when it has momentum on it. But uh, here's my Becky level zero. Have that one, and I do have heroic, full heroic Becky as well. I haven't just proed her yet. I got full heroic Gober, so I'm proed. But I'm sure the females will come in like crazy once the new tier comes in. So I will be beneficial to get that. I do have many, many females, so I'm not completely worried with TBG also and stuff like that. I got at least ten here now. So I'm sure the females will fly in, and I really won't have to worry as much. I'm just a little worried about King of the Rings. But uh, you know, I'm not really truly worried, because I don't think a lot of people are going to be opening packs in this one. You know, Many people seem to skip the mid-tier packs, which I don't blame them. I'm not going to be opening up packs, because I don't like opening up mid-tier, like mid-season. It's just no point unless you're really, really rich, and you know, go for it. Like, yeah, I'm, ri I'm not really rich like that but you know i also rather save my money for other things than supercard mid-season uh i'm like i guess you could say i'm like fifa after team of the year never buy packs again team of the season is a waste of money uh, other stuff like that if you want to be more specific 
so yeah guys uh one more day to go and then i do gotta play this uh elimination chamber now because i got no points at all and i need one i need i need at least two momentum slots for the new tier so that should be fun but yeah anyways uh what i'd like to discuss is what i'd like to achieve in this tier so my goals for this tier is of course to get i would say hit 18k is my goal for this tier um 18k subs so that would be our goal that i would like to hit uh in this tier uh i would like to also get four females before i get a full deck of males kappa not gonna happen and what I like to do in this part of the tier is also, uh, what's it called? Not have any drama whatsoever with any YouTubers or anyone in general. Uh, you know, I do have sometimes, I like to start maybe a problem here and there. I do have the audacity. I will admit that I do have it because people do things that piss me off and then I like to express it. And then some people will jump on the bandwagon with me saying, hey, I, I agree with you. Or the, you'll have the other bandwagon where they'll go, uh, you're a fucking loser. Uh, get over yourself and whatnot. So what I'm gonna do this, this tier is not have any drama. You guys know the bad, the bad things I hate with the clickbaiters, the false advertisers, the bullshit. You guys all know that already, and if you guys fall for that, that's, I guess it's like, okay. You know, I just got to accept that you guys fall for that. I guess that's got to go through my head, like, but, you know, me-wise, I want to just focus on me only and me. That's it. And what's best for the channel, what's best for me, and will be best for you guys in the future as well. So, you know, I'm going to try to not have any drama this tier at all as well, so... Hopefully, we should be A-OK -okay with that, and uh, we shouldn't have any problems. If people do accuse me of stuff, then they're just fucking retarded. Uh, still, to this day, we'll always deny that I did anything like that, but, you know, we'll always have those people accusing you no matter what, even though they are defaming, your, like, me and stuff, so. Uh, it sucks, but, you know, hopefully they just learn to drop it and realize, hey, maybe it wasn't him. All right, guys, so to end off today's video, I'm going to go ahead and show you a better HD picture of the cards that uh, Supercard tweeted out yesterday. The tweet was so blurry and just so like, what the hell is that? Uh, I figured I'd just show the image for you guys here. So I'm going to cover my face and booyah like that. So that is what the new cards look like. Now, I'm just going to keep the name short and simple. I'm going to call it, I'm going to call this tier the cat tier. I am not going to say that full name because, my God, I will botch it every single time, just like Gothic and Goliath. So I'm just going to call this the cat tier, and I must say, those cards do look fantastic. I get a mix. Like, I know a lot of people have said, this looks like LMS cards and Shatter cards. And I'm over here like, don't you guys see Hall of Fame in there too? You know, Hall of Fame has meteorites still, you know? Uh, no? No one's gonna mention Hall of Fame. No, we're just gonna mention LMS and Shattered. Okay, whatever you guys like. But I must say those cards do look fucking great. Uh, I do love the Earth background. So hey, uh, if I had to give it like I would say seven out of ten on design, but uh, I say creativity was lacking a little bit. They could have done something a little bit more than just those rocks. But I can understand where they were going with this. So I'm not gonna truly hate it. I, I do enjoy it. I can't wait to get my freebie. So we'll and hopefully get some ladder rewards too. Supercard add ladders. You're being rude to the people. I think a ladder reward should be every 10k for every person. They should just add that to the game. 10k, 10k, 10k. Give us a reason to play more and more and more. But they just don't. And it's, it's it's mind blowing because we do get cards so easily in TVGs. It's like damn. Imagine just playing 10k games just to get a card. You know, at least they'll feel like okay, it's not bad. I got something out of grinding 10,000 games. Supercard, consider it for the people, man. It's just laziness that we don't have 10k ladders. It really is lazy. Anyway, guys, that's it for me today. I'm Ed. I'll see you guys next time, either Wednesday or Thursday. We're getting started, baby, all over again.